Every day, we're getting updates on new coronavirus cases and deaths because of complications. Our Tiffany Tarpley, though, takes a look at the other side. That's recovery. Walking out of Cleveland Clinic Marymount. It, it just felt good. The breath, the air just like, oh my God, I appreciated it. Was just the first step for Carol Joyner. At home now, the Cleveland realtor spent about 24 hours in the hospital. She was diagnosed with COVID-19 and had to be admitted because she had difficulty breathing. The 60-year-old spoke with me from her hospital bed Thursday. When you tell people that you've been around, you got it, then some people are mean. Every day is getting better. Today I'm able to sit up. The other day I couldn't even hold my head up. While city, county, and state leaders have not yet released numbers of those who've recovered from COVID-19, Johns Hopkins University is keeping a global tally, specifically showing more than 6,000 recoveries in the United States and about 181,000 total cases. Total cases from the CDC are slightly lower. This virus is serious, you know, and it's not getting any better. It's getting worse. While Carol is gaining her strength, she's thankful for the love, support, and prayers she's received from family and friends. It was through God's grace and mercy. I know that's what kept me. She's looking forward to getting back to work and taking her daughter's dog, Dolce, for a walk. I don't want to say near-death experience, but this, this coronavirus, people are dying from it. I live through it. Um, I'm grateful. I don't take it for granted. Tiffany Tarpley. Three news.